Good morning and happy Friday. We have been doing a lot of work on our home, especially on the first floor, and now that it's mostly done, I wanted to show you what our almost four year process of minimalism looks like. Um, it's really reduced the amount of clutter in our home. We only have things that we use for the most part. Uh, this is how the house always looks. Uh, so it's not like I've cleaned up or anything, but I wanna show you kind of what our take is and how it works for us. So from the front door, you come in and this is our family room, living room, whatever you wanna call it. Um, it's the main room with the TV, the big TV. It's two stories. We have to replace that fan yet. Uh, we just had it painted. We just had windows put in. But what you can see is basically enough seating for us. Uh, we can sit and recline and watch TV. We've got lamps in here. We did just put new shades in here as well. Uh, my wife has her yoga things, materials, whatever you want to call them. We have a plant and not much else here other than she did put in some, some uh, things that she likes to put in for decorations. We've got the TV. I've got a smart light down there. These are also smart lights. They all go on uh, right around sunset and they go off automatically around 11, but not much here. There's a chair I'm not crazy about, but we have it here for another person to sit. It's a very simple room. From here, you come into what used to be, originally was the dining room, then was my wife's office for a while. That's why there's a work table there. Uh, not sure what we're gonna do with that. We don't really use the dining room. We've got a bed for Norm. We've got Norm's kettlebell. I'm kidding, that's my wife's. Uh, my wife does her Peloton Digital on this non-Peloton bike, which was much cheaper. We do not have or want shades here. We like to have light come in. I have a plant that's not really working out too well here, but I'm not sure if it's gonna stay. We've got a Roomba, all of our keys, a little bit of uh, tech here. I've got a home assistant server running on a Raspberry Pi. I don't like to leave that stuff out, but it has to be connected via ethernet to a router access point. So that's why that's there. Disconnected is our Y space station. We've got keys, etc. Normally we don't have anything here, but I need to replace the closers on our screen door or storm door this weekend. So that's why they're there, just to remind me. But other than that, nothing else. Uh, my wife uses this for uh, puzzles nowadays. So that's that. Uh, we've got our bathroom there. We haven't done anything to that yet. We're still in the process of pulling up the carpet. Uh, I'm not sure what we're going to do here. We're going to plant. Uh, my wife also painted these, uh, the handrail and banister. Um, it was all wood colored. We like the black and white. You come into what I call <laughs> my study and there's not much here either. There's another plant. There's Norm's toys. There's a little little table that my wife typically has breakfast on. She and I both kind of sit here. I sit in my recliner and she sits on the Ikea couch uh, and has breakfast in the morning. This is my little workstation when I'm not in the home office upstairs. It's a little, I'd call this cluttered because it's got a bunch of my devices and knickknacks and such. But I sit here for hours every day, make coffee, work. I have a lamp for reading at night. I've got a window to look outside. Uh, we have not yet changed the stone around the fireplace, but other than that, we just had all this redone. Um, I'm thinking maybe we'll do a reclaim wood from the top to the fireplace at some point. Just a couple things of use here on the mantle. Oh, I got an outlet switch I got to do. And we've got our kitchen. Again, not a lot of clutter, not a lot of stuff. Seating for three, we just had this all done about two years ago. Um, had a much smaller island in the past. Uh, so we have the island with my reading list, a saunas, a couple plants, and that's really all about it in here. Um, we have a water dispenser that my wife wanted, and another chair, Norm's food and water. My son who makes cabinets made this to hold extra water, which is very nice. He did that for Barb's birthday. Got the deck out back, more plants. Again, 
simple. We changed this from a regular door in the pantry to a barn door. Um, I guess it's kind of weird to show you the inside of my pantry, but you know, just, just enough stuff, not a ton. Um, I use the June oven every day as a smart oven. We keep a lot on the countertops though. I mean, just stuff we know we're going to use every day and some plants and cookbooks. Um, there's usually nothing there, but my wife made cupcakes a couple days ago. So that's there until they're gone. She has her smart tea kettle and I've got my Keurig and my meds. And really that's about it. I mean, this is how we live. And to be honest, again, when you have clutter, it's just, it clutters your mind. At least it does for me. And we've gotten rid of everything that we're just not using. That's why there's not a lot of furniture in here. What we use every day to sit on, to eat, to sit on and work, uh, to do puzzles, <laughs> and to sit and watch TV. I mean, maybe it looks staged. I don't know, but it is such a relaxing, relaxing environment. And, uh, and I'm so thrilled that I went down this journey. So anyway, it's something to consider if uh, you have a lot of stuff and most Americans have stuff. George Carlin used to say, what do we get bigger houses for? To put in more stuff. Um, we downsized our house and we got rid of a lot of stuff. We donated a lot of stuff. And every week I try and get rid of something that we're not using and donate it. And if I buy something new, like when I buy a new chair, I will, well, I should soon because that's a nice butt print. Um, I will replace this chair. This chair will go. Everything gets, when something comes in, something goes out in this house. That's just, otherwise we just end up with more stuff and we don't want that. So anyway, something to consider, you know, uh, I, I really appreciate this whole minimal lifestyle that we've taken on and it's really, really done a world of good for my mental health. So I hope you enjoyed this.